Welcome to CAT Tutorials, and in this video, I'll be covering practice problem 6.9. We are given inductance of value 2 Henry's and this formula for its voltage, and as well as a, an initial current, which is stored in it, of 2 amperes. And we are asked to find the current as well as the energy stored in it at time equals to 4 seconds. So we know for sure that V is equals to L di divided by dt. And the first part asks us to find the current. So what we'll do is we just cross multiply and integrate to finally have a formula which says I is equals to 1 over L integral of V dt, not forgetting to add the initial condition which we're given in the question, right? So now that we have this formula, we are basically just going to integrate and substitute the, the limit from 0 to 4 seconds as given to us in the question. So let's do that. So i is equal to a half. The 2 comes from the value of the inductor as given to us in the question. And integral of 10, 10, um, let me just write this properly, 1 subtract t dt plus 2, right? So that is that, and we, um, <coughs> excuse me, just gonna proceed to do the integral. So i is equal to 10 over two, multiplying everything inside the limits from zero to four, we are gonna have t subtract t squared divided by two from zero to four, and not forgetting to add the two, which is the initial condition, so now we have i is equal to 5 multiplied by substituting 4 in here. We have 4 subtract 4 squared, which is 16. 16 divided by 2 is 8. And we are also going to subtract 0 and 0 so uh, put in there, which is going to be something like that, and add 2 to this. So this is going to be 5 multiplied by 4 subtract 8 is negative 4. So negative 4 and finally add 2. So i at time is equal to 4 seconds is equal to negative 20 plus 2, which is equals to negative 18 amperes. So this is our answer for the first part of the question. Moving on to the second part of the question, which asks us to find the energy. The formula for energy of an inductor is W equals to half Li squared. Now that we are interested in two points and we're actually given the initial condition, we should uh, consider from zero to four, which means this is what we're gonna do. Half L I at time four squared, subtract half L I at time zero squared, right? So this is what we basically have in our, in our question. And this is how we approach this particular problem from this point on. So now that we found the, the current at time four, which was there, which is negative, 18, so half L, which is 2, and then multiply by negative 18 squared, subtract half L, which is 2, and I0, which is 2 as well, squared. Now, punching this into your calculator should give you W between 0 and 4, or at 4 is equals to 320 joules. And that is how you solve this particular problem.